Mm -hmm. Right, so guys, I've just started recording on YouTube. Welcome to Celtic v or oh, Celtic v Celtic match watch along live. We're all, we're live on Twitch, so why don't you earn Twitch first? But it's on YouTube as well. By the time I'm recording, I'm with Lewis, of course. I'm um, on Discord. We're going to talk. Okay, good. Which will be good. Yeah, they can. Yeah. I'm just watching some of the adverts for Sky Sports. And there's a um oh what's it called? It's it's not the big mat, it's the big tasty. They're just a big for McDonald's. Oh my god. That is massive. Mad. Yeah. Hmm. You watch the um. Oh, what's the guy's name? Oh, thingies on it as well. That um, where the movie we're watching in history. Oh, on Amazon Prime, video. Oh yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's that's. Oh, the guy goes very nice, very nice. Oh, I can't remember his name. The program. The picture is the house's front door. One of the front doors of the two beside each other. One of them leads right to stairs. Mm -hmm. You don't know those stairs there. You're gonna walk in, and then all the only thing people are gonna hear is this. <laughs> That's you falling down the stairs. Oh, first thing I would be seeing insurance claim. <laughs> yeah. Me first. That's a when alive after that. <laughs> I mean, I if you're alive. Uh. Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Really? Mm. Well, the first one was quite good. I'll probably watch two of the different videos. Yeah, I liked the first one. That was good, man. I don't know why it's going to be released, but I just heard that they're, they've announced them. I never would have expected the second one. Yeah. But, hell. Yeah, because I just thought that, you know, it's just going to be a movie, because it, it was like, um... Yeah. We've had two draws in the last six games. We've had, hold on, come on, hurry up, Sky Sports. I want to see the the wins. We've had one loss, which is a St. Mirren game. Terrible goal keeping from Scott Bain. Uh, three wins, which is uh, good. <laughs> okay. I like the Edwards goal the best. Hmm. Oh, you're talking about football for me. Right, so I've just got a 
Oh, Brown's got a header against um, Kamara. That was a good one. The smallest man. Like, I wouldn't expect Scott Brown to do a, a header, and he does. So, mad. Oh, Malibu are beating Kamara. Kamara oh, just under the new manager, 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 Tommy Wright, who used to be the St. Johnson manager. That's about 10 minutes to go in that game, so Tommy Wright, is, uh, Tommy Wright only has like 10 minutes to get a draw or a I don't know, spectacular win. I just hope the team plays the way we did against Marlowe on Saturday for the first 60 minutes. If we don't concede, the thing is, if we don't concede, I think we'll play good, like the way we did against Kamarnock. You know, it's the, I think, remember, you, we watched it, Gilbert, when Marlowe scored, we just deflated like a balloon. Like... And Laxell's 90th minute clearance after the line man saved us. Oh Aye, um, St Stephen Welsh and Christopher I have a very similar look when you see pictures of them. <laughs> Already look quite similar. It's the haircut that does it for me. Yeah, it's the hair. Because the, the, the. Yeah. Oh, God. It's like if you walked up. the exact same colour as one. If you walked up to them in the street, like, you. I probably wouldn't mean to tell the difference. I'd say, Christopher I are being embarrassed if it, it could turn up saying, No, I'm Stephen Welsh. <laughs> oh. Dad, you just have to wait for Zeb to say the first word. Mm. Well, because I guess there's quite the difference between a Scottish and a Mm. Aye, like if you're if you if they're talking like if they're having a conversation, but imagine if he's just on his own walking back to his house or a car, right? Yeah. So guys, the top right hand, oh, right hand corner, wait, oh my God, um, is Lewis's prediction and mine. Lewis's is two one Celtic and mine is one 0 Celtic. Lewis's are more realistic because well, we can't we can cheat. But. Ah, can you stop shouting, please? I'm gonna moderate. Oh, you're gonna moderate. Shall I? Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's quite impressive, Lee. Ah. <laughs> That's quite impressive, Lee. <laughs> oh. Oh, <good>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, basically, how I get that picture, or I'll save it from Instagram, of course, or wherever the, you know, yeah. when Celtic post it. Yeah. And then I go to, so full screen, of course, I'm on. Uh, and then I add source and I go to image, and then, like, I have to scroll down to the latest Instagram image. <laughs> Uh, there you go, that's it. It's quite impressive. And text. I remember what, like, I remember one of your first, uh, and it was, uh, it was on PlayStation, but the first thing on PC was an update. Oh my and god. And you barely, I mean, you barely get it to run. And now you, now you've got Yes, full proper setup. Yep. To be fair, I don't know what the most advanced setup after you turn a live watch along. Yeah. And I've watched, like, you've got your fog suits and all of that with the, and Mark Goldridge. Mark Goldridge is the one that's more impressive, so. Well, of course, you can never be Mark Goldridge in one watch or but the fog thing. Yeah. Like, oh, really? Such a difference. Like, not even, like, your production quality. If you're comparing it, Fog is a solid five. Yours is a solid nine and a half. Yeah, because all he has, like, is the, you know, the scores yeah. of the teams, really. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I'm like a, a Mark Gold, a rip-off Mark Gold, who's like, I don't have the green screen. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. And you don't have, like, obviously the formation up and all that. No. I mean, I could get that up if I, like, if I got a picture, but yeah. that would... Yeah. But there was, 
See, there's no Mark Goldrich as the. The reason that you're not a 10 is because Mark Goldrich is a 10. Yeah. The, yeah, I'd give Mark Goldrich a 10 anyway, he's hilarious. Yeah. So. Yeah, that's just that. Yeah. Oh, I couldn't save this guy at the beginning of the game. Lewis, did you just say, wait a minute, how did this guy end up in the school? Oh my god. That sounds a bit dodgy. Well, <laughs> but right, so at the beginning of the game, you have a mission to save a guy. I never saved him, but he's it. And most of the time, early on in the game, we bring him with you. Mm -hmm. But he's just randomly spawned yeah. in a school. <laughs> oh. I didn't see them. I can't even do the mission because it's broken. I killed all the enemies I've got to kill, but oh. now I can't do any. So. Yeah. You know, Fallout 4 has had so many glitches that just randomly happen. But this is probably the weirdest um, one I've had so far. At least I don't have to deal with him constantly giving me missions. Yeah. Kick off, guys. Reminder is 20 minutes. No minutes, don't kick off. Oh, that's cool how you have, like, comments to say about the production quality on this. What do you mean by, like, what, like... <laughs> and almost nobody, like, comments it. Oh, right, right, right. Like, if they have for, like... Like, first they had a 10 years, for example. Yeah. The production quality on this one. Um, Bart Goldridge got nothing on you. Also, Bart Goldridge himself is really impressed. Yeah, I think he's worked with, um, obviously the Alien 80 stand people, like, to get that, yeah. obviously. Obviously he just puts, like, green screen up and then it turns up, of course, like, the scene. But, yeah. Yeah. Two minutes. I'm saying my prediction is the most realistic. Oh yeah, I don't know why I say one now, but I just said one yeah. now in my prediction, so I'm going with. No, you're just used to Celtic winning last. Oh, I definitely like this as well. So, a lot of other like trophies and stuff that I watch, it's just the person. A lot of the time, it's a. Uh, I'm also here, and if I'm not here, normally I give you a prediction anyway. Carry on fighting cancer, but... mm, nope, that's a Spotify advert. Mm, I mean. <laughs> right. You always got to have Spotify in the back for some good music. Yeah, got to have non copyright though, because I'm recording as well. So. Listen, you need to be close 11 and 8 years. Oh. Also, I can see people who have subscribed to me on YouTube. I'm going to have well. to mute myself for a second, though. Okay. Arie, shut up! Okay, just unmute yourself when you're ready. Uh, Arie, did you just say could you, could you quiet down a bit? Like, you're screaming and I'm obviously on the stream too. So I like watch along. So, could you please be so kind as to, you know, not be as loud? Thank you. Right, Liam, I'm back. Alright. Um, Still with the stuff. Oh, brown's going. Five seconds. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to mess up. I was saying, if I ever forget the lineup, I can real quickly just repeat the touch. Oh my god. Oh god. <laughs> I didn't mean to press that. <laughs> I pressed on, I clicked on my YouTube, and it, that, that's the video that comes up, and obviously all my other plays, and that's the intro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need a circle to <laughs> Like and subscribe, and it's five seconds, or spam your own call down your phone, and in your sleep. Oh. I'm telling you now, that was an absolute iconic intro you should never have <laughs> gone rid of.
Wait, if I, see if I, set, like, I, see if I even search up on like, right, Google, right? Mark yeah. Gold, Gold Bridge, Gold Bridge, Coops. Oh, that's not how you spell Coops. There we go. There we go. Lindelof off couldn't mark a toddler's spelling test. He's slower than a snail's funeral. We're defending like a bunch of drunk badgers in a sleeping bag. Jesse Lingard is as useful as a hot dog in a vegetarian conven convention. Wait a minute. Wait. Stop for a second. Are you sure you were talking about Victor Lindelof? <laughs> He's been quite good this season, the man has passes like nobody else. Um, people also ask, is Mark Goldbridge real? <laughs> people also ask, is Mark Goldbridge an Nottingham spot and a, a Nottingham Forest fan? People call me a Forest fan because I'm from Nottingham, says Goldbridge. My dad is a Chelsea fan and my mum's a United fan, but we lived in Nottingham, so my dad used to take me to watch Forest games on the weekends. Yeah, sure, sure you know Oh, right, I'm going what on to... big bat stories in football history. Right, here we go. Phil Jones, a professional football. Uh, right, here we go. Mark go right, this is Mark Goldbridge. I'm crying at Mark Goldbridge. What a reaction. Here we go, yeah, and, and now we're getting torn apart because the heads will drop. Oh. It's both yeah, of them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right, I'm not going to... Really? I, I just want to see the quotes. I don't want to bother seeing... Oh, it's the videos, right? Okay, so let's see that. See on your um, streams, have your fans ever recommended... Like specific videos. I mean music. Like music? No. Or do they, or do they just let you use whatever? Um. No, I like I I would ask, but there's not really anybody in the chat. I'm not And most of the time, sometimes I'm recording, so, 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 um, I just want to see somebody, I want to see the best, I want to see the best, co I want to see, Joshim, oh my god, I just want to see some, I just want to see some best Mark Goldbridge quotes. Oh, I can get him on. I'll see what I want to see what he's on Twitter. I want to see what his Twitter is saying. Now. I remember back in season eight of Fortnite, right? We were, um, we used to always sing that. Yeah. I used to have that in the background in my music as well. Yeah. I bloody hate old Timbo. Fight. Oh. <laughs> 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 pressed again. It pressed again. <laughs> I have it uploaded so I can I can hear you saying it's the football as well. Um, right. At least on the Celtic Mind podcast, I don't have it on any videos specific on the when you open it up. There's a child in here. <laughs> you know what? Do 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 Yeah, I know, because I've never actually seen them before, in the game. So, you know, this is actually quite new. Ten minutes took it off, guys, ten minutes. Well, I hope we win. Because we can't keep it so cheap, so it's safe to say we won. 
I'll get the shit down, shit down. <laughs> I've started getting the set downs up. Probably one of those you know bloody you YouTubers, or I don't know, just something, I don't know. I don't know, I know, the world's gone mad, I tell you. <laughs> um, that lockdown really made everybody go insane. Funny football quote. If you eat caviar every day, it's diffi difficult to return to sausages, Arsene Wenger quote. Uh, Chris Kamara, the atmosphere is thick and fast. fast. <laughs> um, um, oh, come on, I want to see more. 20, the 20, the 20 funniest football quotes ever. Here we go. Come on, Unai Emery, good evening. See, like, oh, no, Morgan, Scottish footballer, Lewis Morgan, FIFA 21, Lewis Morgan, Higuain, Lewis Morgan, Ida Magidi. <laughs> What's the search up Lewis Morgan, you know? <laughs> Remember in primary seven, everybody used to ask me, because Lewis Morgan scored for a Celtic. Good. Something asked me how it felt to score. Or, throughout all of first year and second year, especially with 52. What's Miami like? Gurek footballer Lewis Morgan completes 300k Celtic deal. <laughs> no, I was, I, it was really annoying everybody asking me. Oh, see some images. How my arm is like? Um. I mean, you, you, I mean, oh my. <laughs> I just said to stop Lewis Morgan. Can you, Lewis Morgan, can you know what it went? <laughs> oh my god. What's pop pop? There's a, oh my god, it's hilarious, man. Um. Uh, as long as it's not me. How is it going to be long life? Oh, what? No, I don't want to do that, no. no. Oh, man. Do you remember? Uh, where is it? Actually, I'll go. Right, so if I go back to S1 on Twitter, um, Mr. Oh, what was it? I need to go back to the last January. Remember we did the mummy, muff, muff, <laughs> no, I can't speak English. Mummification. Oh yeah, and then I ended up being. Is that what? I was on Twitter as no. well, man. Everyone, yeah, it was really tight on you. <laughs> I mean, Bailey just kept wrapping it in. We just wasted all the toilet paper. Yeah. yeah, at the back, I think somebody knew. Like, it was that, Bailey. Was it was Bailey. Paper, so that was actually hard to take off. It was Bailey. <laughs> we tied it at the back. <laughs> Oh, 11th of May, right? Oh, that was a lady. That was a hilarious man. Oh, might not for you, but I was a hilarious man. <laughs> it was quite funny. Right, I'm going. Oh my god, I'm going all the way back to the. Right, come on, um, April. Come on, go back to January. Come on. Wait, what do you think was the best moment in S1? Ooh, best moment in S1? Um, oh, I don't, I, I don't even know, like, pro, maybe like history or funny things, like, you know, just... Also, yeah. also you're not allowed to ask me questions because I don't have enough for it. Oh, that's tough. Um, <laughs> come on, I just want to see um, Lewis's wrapping up picture. You know, whenever I say something, it sounds quite weird, but if you could see my screen, yeah. it would make more sense. Because here we go, here we go. That's right. what on. I was about to say. Why is everybody bald here? <laughs> <laughs> right, come on, I want to see yours. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, <laughs> oh, I'm getting myself up. I don't think it's just that funny. <laughs> the picture Mr. McDougal took took us a <laughs> Oh <laughs> It's not oh, it's loose it's your face Lewis, it's the way your face is, right? Oh there's one way, there's one way Damien way James is wrapped up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh my god. Do you remember that time? Oh, what's his name? Oh. oh my god, I forget his name, but he asked James, How d are you proud to be a foot? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. And then our art teacher asked him that. Five minutes. He's asked that question <laughs> so many times. I'm going back in office. Well, like, I feel like, I feel like, think about it. Mm -hmm. If I have the power to, I'd be thinking if you ask him that question, I'd have to. It's not much, but it's good that I have to explain. Yeah. Five minutes still kick off, guys. Actually, four minutes, actually. Oh, I am. <laughs> you, I cannot contain my excitement. Oh, I'm still going to laugh Oh, I am still going to myself laughing at that picture. Alright, Liam, I don't think it's that funny. Uh, <laughs> right, I won't show it in stream because that's like, that's probably illegal. <laughs> nah, because you'll get posted. It's perfectly legal. Everyone gave permission to your school. No, well, then. But I still wouldn't if I were you just in case. Yeah, because it's going on YouTube. I'm not bloody putting it on. Um, here I'll send you the link to it, right? Hey, I'm, um, actually, yeah, I might do that. Yeah, I'll send you the picture. You've not seen the picture? No. Oh, let me fall in the Right, okay. I still, I'm still surprised you've not seen the picture, man. Wait, do you know what you saw me? Why does it sell us? I've never seen it. Right, there we go. Man, you're not a drama Fortnite can Make as astounding. What is it? Oh, Mother's Drama Fortnite can make oh. astounding. Oh, yeah. Oh my god. You know, I don't think I've ever used that word before. Astounding. <laughs> Were we at any other pictures before that? That's all I know. I don't. What's the reason? Oh, do you remember? And P7, we had to take, obviously it was picture day, and it, well not picture day, but we were going for a, a picture, and then we had to all sit outside on the hill, but oh. everyone was facing everybody's face, yep, yep, yep. and so everybody ended up making weird faces. Oh yeah, and it was in the paper as well, that was the most sour thing. Yeah, and then everybody's like mum or dad or whatever was, <laughs> was like engaging with it. That was my or son, was that was my son or daughter's picture, you ruined yeah. it. Or they were just... Or they were like angry. <laughs> like I don't mind Fortnite, but it's like the fact like how the like, how long the season goes on. That's how that's what ruins yeah. it. Like this this season yeah. season five doesn't start. Uh, season six doesn't start till like the end yeah. of February. So. Yeah, like it was cool points to me, me bro. It's good that you have more time, like, okay. but it also gets bored, bored quite quickly. Yeah, like, if, like, do you know what, I, do you know the, like, what, see if they kept helicopters, I like helicopters, they were good. You have, you have oh, hard, are... you have hardly any rotation now if you played Fortnite, if you play Fortnite now. Yeah. I've never, ever used this word before, but helicopters are very, uh, what's it called? uh, here comes Celtic now. Celtic going out the St. Martin Tunnel. Here we go. Helicopters were very common 
Uh, here at first on the newly almost seven channel. There you go, and on Twitch. Also, oh, the last time. Celtic wearing their uh, away kit, the you know the little, uh, green kit. Yeah. The away kit's quite nice. Yeah, I like every kit has the clover on the back. It you know the wee clover on the back. Yeah. And yeah, my personal favourite is the third kit. Yeah, the black one's the best. I like it. Just a simple clover, you know, as a badge. Yeah. And everyone in the chat must. Everyone, everyone's very thankful as a Celtic supporter that Shane Duffy isn't starting. Last time out against, yes! and last time out against uh, St Mirren, away back in September we faced them away back um, away at P in Paisley. We won two one loose. So your prediction. So. Uh, back back then though we didn't have Scott Benigo. It was Barkas. I want to say. I want to say Barkas. But, yeah. Oh God. Bain is just small. Like that goal already deflected, but come on. That was a shocker. I wonder why he has just probably recently. I know he's a youth, but he's like the height of him, you know? You know? I would say Hazard and Bain are very different. Yeah. Bain's a lot faster and makes less mistakes. Yeah. But I think Hazard's just a bit better. Yeah. Here comes St Mirren now and the managers come down, the referees as well. The teams, of course, for St Mirren first, it's Anwick, Dungo, X Rangers, Keeper, Fraser, McCarthy, Shaughnessy, Connolly, Flynn, Doyle Hayes, Er Hannon, Dumfries, uh, Dum yeah, Dumfries, Graf and Obika uh, on the bench for St Mirren is the Linus, uh, Mason, Finlayson, Tate, McPherson, McAllister, Jameson, Henderson, that's it. And the starting lineup for Celtic now: Scott Bain, John Joe Kenny, um, Stephen Welsh, Christopher Ryan, Greg Taylor. In midfield, it's Scott Brown, David Turnbull, Tom Rogic, and Cal McGregor. And up front, it's Albina Yeti alongside Odson Edward. And there you go. Very interesting. Well, it's a cold one up at Paisley. Hopefully, yeah. Hopefully, Yeti plays well. Yep. Say that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, you can't just call people the target. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Jeez Louise. Oh jeez, Len doesn't look happy when bloody um the St. Mary manager came over to fist bump him. Jesus. Looks like he's gonna punch him. <laughs> the fist bump, oof. Oh god, Adam, but Adam, you can't say that. And it is a Yeti to kick off for Celtic now, and it is live. I'm Martin Pylon. Celtic kick off in Paisley. Hopefully we win. I'm not confident we'll keep up a clean sheet. I think it'll be another 2-1. Uh, right, so you thought 1-0 Celtic. Yeah. Can I ask why you... I don't, I don't know. I, I said that in my, my, my preview. I thought, you know what? It sounds like a Celtic result, but we'll find out. An old Celtic result? Oh, yeah. <laughs> An old Celtic result, yeah. Now, will this be the 2-1 again? No. Well, well Scott Bain and goals, we're not keeping a clean. Even with Hazard and goals, we're not keeping a clean sheet. Come on, pressure them. Come on. Stop lazy. Come on, Ayeti. Run for it. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, run for Ayeti. Turnbull. Play, keep it. Look, Taylor, you have the touch of an elephant. Bloody, he runs up the park. He runs up there, right, and he's going to get it, and he bloody touches it like an elephant. I, I'm not watching much, but I trust you. You already see already. What about it in the game? Jim, Jim Goodwin still standing up there telling his players what to do. Lenny's sitting on his bum and just sitting there. That's a free kitty. Eh? St. Mirren. <coughs> They're just going to cross this ball into the box. That's our dangerous. It's from it's 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 from Welsh. I mean, that's, that's a stupid free kick away Welsh, you know. And he's just went into the back room. but he's, they've took it short somewhere. I don't know. They must not learn. They I don't know much about what's going on. What were you saying? I'll I'll believe. Celtic have won it back. 
No, they haven't, never mind. St. Men have got it back now. Bloody hell. Jesus Christ. Oh, and I... Oh, my... No free kick, thank you, referee. Brown's got it back now. Oh, my God, Brown, pass it to a Celtic player. They've not scored, but... Yeah, pass it to a Celtic player. Celtic can't con control the ball. Like, it's just, like, two minutes of the game. St. Mirren are just, you know... Oh, that's Celtic's ball. But St. Mirren are just literally just controlling this game right now. I'm not even kidding. Lennon's still standing up, but... Doesn't look like he's saying into his team. Just look, doing this into the ground. Just looking into the ground, staring into the earth. Saying... What am I doing as a Celtic manager? He should be telling players what to do. After the complaints you've had recently, he just doesn't talk to the players. Yeah, that would happen when we face him in at Celtic Park. Jim Wood stand. Even when he's winning 2 1 or 1 0, he's still up there talking to his players saying, keep going, keep going, we're going to get a goal. And they did. They got the three points. So I don't understand yeah. why Lennon sits there and thinks, I'm going to get a result. It's just... Yeah, it, even in the Motherwell match, even though it was late in the game, there was no way they were going to bring it back. Yeah. The man was still chilling at them. Yeah. Telling them to just keep moving. Oh, well done there yeah. from Rogic. Magic feet. Passes it. Oh, bloody hell, Rogic. He got... He got... He done the hard part and he couldn't even pass the ball, but... John Joe Kenny done well to block yeah. it there from the pass and it will be a St Mirren throw in, but... Up in half of there, St Mirren, but... Rogic, Wizard of Oz with the feet there. Done well. He's done the hard part. It's just the passing in the end. You know, I said, I see. You know, it's only three minutes into the game, but you got to get that first goal. You got to get it. Yeah. Look at the space he's got. Where's he defending? I mean, lucky I went bloody wide, but that is shocking defending. Where's the defence? I don't know where. Stephen Welsh is trying to attack. No, is that John? No, it's not. It's Greg Taylor's trying to tackle him in the ball, and Greg Taylor's, you know, small, right? You know. So I don't know where Stephen Welsh are. Oh, bloody hell, Stephen Welsh. What are you doing? Passing it straight, bloody, to the bloody St Mirren player. Here comes St Mirren. Oh, no, not Welsh. Bloody. Are we, is our players not strong or something? Are we, are we been taking a week's holiday or something? Like, have we not trained? If it was up to Lenny, we'd have a whole month off. I probably go to bloody Dubai again. You're well in from turn Taylor or Turnbull. I don't Taylor. Pass it, Eddie. Pass it, Taylor. You'll get on the end there. Crosses it in. Jesus Christ, Taylor. Jesus Christ on a bloody bike. Oh, he done it. Edward with a good pass to Taylor. But what? It, right, so here comes Edward, and it passes it Taylor. Yeah. We, we always get the hard parts though, but when it comes to the easy parts, like finishing the ball, getting mm -hmm. to it, like that should be, we should, that should be uh, the easy part, we just can't do that either. Taylor cannot cross a ball. Edward gave him a brilliant ball at wide, the left hand side. Oh, Brown wins it back. Bloody hell, Roger, you can't pass a bloody ball. Um, and oh, can, this is a bad Roger. Jesus Christ. Roger. Oh, thank God. But Bain came out there to grab it. Barkas wouldn't do that. Barkas would just stand back with his big goalie hands like that. <laughs> um, nah, wait. Here's a perfect explanation of Rogic. Some things he plays well, some things he doesn't. It's different every match. Yeah, different every match, definitely. Ayer, Welsh. If one match playing like Thomas Miller, the next match he's right. playing like some... Like 50 Roger. old Bob the Plumber. Logic, what are you doing? Passing it back the way. What are you doing? Let's <sighs> give away a throw in. It's at Mirren. That is stupid. Browns gave a good ball to you, Logic, and what are you doing? You mess it up. <sighs> Jeez, this is going to be a long night. I tell you that. It's going to be a long night of football. This is at Mirren. We should put any team out there and beat St. Mirren. We can't even beat bloody St Mirren. That's embarrassing. If you can't even beat St Mirren, what's the point of even saying you're a title race? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? If you can't even beat bloody St Mirren. I mean, we're not in the title race. I know, if you were in a title race, right? Imagine if you were in a title race. Yeah. If you can't even beat St Mirren, that's embarrassing. Fair play to Jim Goodwin, though. He's got his team well. John Joe Kenny gets it clear. 
good defending, but we're slack, slack at the back. Set from John O'Kenny. Pass the ball. I mean, where's that to? I mean, Ayeti's not going to get there in a million years. That's brilliant defending from St Mirren. I mean, John Joe Kenny gets it back, but he can't get it to anybody. Oh, God. You have just not been still at all recently. Welsh headers are on. But a fall straight to St Mirren player. I mean, Welsh does, you know, good defending, but Celtic, a Celtic player should be there to get the, the heading ball from Welsh. Yeah. Here comes St oh Mirren. God, this is a bad man. It's 1M games again. Oh, well done, Brown. It's That's our ball. Yes, referee. Sit down. Sit down, St Mirren. Sit oh, down. I got the Rogic, he changes every match, but then you've got your Welsh and Irish who are consistently good. And then there's your egg for like they're, they're decent every match, but they're not Yeah. What are you doing, John Joe Kenny? Pass it to him. Oh, Jesus. This is just going to be one. I, I mean, Lewis, I mean, I thought your prediction was going to be the you know, the best result, but I don't see Celtic scoring. I mean, I see St Midland scoring, but I don't see Celtic scoring at the moment. Eight minutes gone, nil-nil. I guess this is just one of our bad games. It's one of those games again Saturday, Lewis. It nearly gave, nearly gave us a heart attack or a stroke, so... That's what Honestly, now Celtic is just like Rogic. One match he's good. Taylor. Good. The next match, uh, as I was saying, one match we're good. The next match we're uh, kind of the opposite of good. That's a foul, ref. That's a foul. Oh, thank God, John Joe Kenny was out of clear. Well, that was a foul. Somebody just back backed into bloody eye or a Welsh there and bloody took him out. I mean, that's hard to do that. I mean, they're bloody tall, but tall people, innit? Here comes St Mirren. Bloody hell, that's good play. Was that a goal kick? Corner kick, St Mirren, nine minutes gone. Corner kick. No, no wonder Greg Taylor's not happy, because he's not performed well either. He passes it straight to the St Mirren player. You know, it's shocking. Oh, God. <laughs> We can't, this is again, zonal marking, oh my, bl oh my bloody god. It's the no, same I with bloody Man United, the, nobody defends the back post. Like, it's impossible to defend. It's possible to defend that, like, zonal marking. No, no I'm kind of glad I'm not able to watch the game live. Oh, Jesus. Welsh with a free kick to John Joe Kenny. Over here, I get it. Turnbull. What's Turnbull then trying to play for Bloody Bar? Oh, it's a sore one on John Joe Kenny and over a free kick at Celtic. High boots on Kenny there. That'll be a free kick at Celtic. Yeah, it's a high boot. You know, it's he's coming in for it. Oh, right in the ear. Right in the ear. It's a sore one. On the you boot. know what? I would love right now Celtic to just be able to have three boots in a row. Oh, yeah. <laughs> John Joe Kenny takes the, uh, is going to take the free kick. I don't know how his crosses are. I've not seen him do free kick crosses. So Crosses it in. Over. Bloody hell, he's trying to get brown, but it will fall to a Yeti. Celtic's ball. Celtic's ball on the edge of St Mirren's, you know, box, I would say, for one. <laughs> come on, create something here, Celtic, come on. Can right, um, right, I need to move the screen a bit. Right. Uh, right. Turnbull. Goes back to Ayer. Who will go back to Scott Bain. Oh, we'll go back to Ayer. It's just like football manager, Lewis. Bloody. Just go back and forward, back and forward. Mm. Here comes Ayer now, sprinting down the I middle of the park. Ayer. Passes it to, is that Turnbull? I don't know. I don't know who that is. Edward, turns. Edward, shoot the ball, Edward. Shoot it. Far too many touches, Edward. Welsh, that's brilliant, Welsh. Well in, Welsh. Sit down. Ah, he goes down like he's got a sore arm. Look at that. He goes down like he's got a sore arm. <laughs> well done, Welsh. He defends brilliantly, Welsh. Brilliantly. I think he's, he's injured himself. Tell you, he's going to be one of the best. 
if you could put mm-hmm. like this. It's it's actually the normal play, uh, the submarine player. It's actually filled Welsh. He the, the submarine player heads it on and well, and then he pulls back Welsh, and he's instead he's injured himself. The submarine player as well, and he I think he's pretending he's hurt his shoulder, <laughs> pretending. Now, I'm see if Welsh continues this before he leaves the SPFL. Best, um, one of the best defenders in the SPFL history. <sighs> and being so young as well, you know, he could get on a good career. I think he's like, is it eight, maybe 19, 20? I don't know. Oh, thank you. Welsh back on his feet. Good to see him back on his feet. He's well, but... It looks like St Mirren player can't continue, it looks like he's dislocated his shoulder. I don't know how he's done it, but he's dislocated his shoulder. <laughs> and Jamie McGrath will have to come off the park. 12 minutes gone. St Mirren will have to make an early substitution. I mean, I don't know how he's managed that, I really don't. He fouled well, Welsh and he managed to fall over, I don't... Yeah. God knows how he's done it, I really don't. Yeah, he's got to be a special kind of player too. And to film somebody and then they do themselves doing it. It's like Morello's trying to get a penalty right and he's injured himself in it. So, mm. it's a bit like that. Well, the doctors for St Mirren have got the guy's, in a, the guy's arm in a sling, so must be bad, eh? Must be bad. Because mm. you, you, obviously you can't play on like that with an arm like that, you know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It comes out. Brown, over to Tam Rajik. Back to Welsh, over to Ayer. Ayer over to McGregor. Edward, back to Ayer. Come on, we need to get a bit of football going, that's it. Get a bit of football going, Taylor. Ayeti, goes back to Brown. Turnbull, Welsh. Welsh drives forward a bit. Go on, keep going forward, go on. Over to uh, Turnbull, finds a bit of space. It's clear. Brown has it now. Taylor. He'll go to Ayer. Welsh, we're getting a bit of football done now. Come on. McGregor. Who's that? Rogic. Rogic with the magic feet. Gets a, a throw in itself in the... Near the corner, for, nearly a corner for Celtic, but it's a throw in. And that substitution will be made for St Mirren. It is Kyle McAllister coming on for Jamie McGrath. Ooh, oh. John Joe Kenny with the throw in. You still early, yeah? Well, I'm still here. Yeah, it's fine. Just checking. Not much else to do. Uh, Rogic. Rogic, shoot! Yes! Celtic score! It's Tam Rajik, the Wizard of Oz. Sit down, St Mirren, sit down. Yes! It's Tom Rajik, I told him to shoot it and he does. He calls it into the bottom corner. It's St Mirren now, Celtic 1. Hey, you're going to want to update that on your screen. Oh, yep. There we go. There we go, got that done. It's Tam Rajik. Perfect, look at that curl on it. It's his curling boots on today. He's got his lovely curling boots, look at that. Oh, that's obscene, that is. That's perfect from lovely, absolutely beautiful play. And that's a lovely goal. We're 1-0 up. We haven't deserved a goal, but we've got a goal, eh? Uh, well, that's, God don't mind. Hmm. Uh, Pretty decent. Well, he's been bad so far, but if he scores, there you go. I can forgive him. Right now, if I was in football manager, I'd go out um, very defensive. <laughs> we still get a couple of goals at it. Tell you that. And the goal was scored in 15 minutes. There you go. Yeah, 
St. Mirren have a dangerous yeah. free kick here. Crosses in. That's keeper's ball. Well in Bain, well in Bain. Get it out and get, getting it in his safe hands. Protecting his area, as I would, as keepers just say. It's a header. It's, I mean, it's a header. I mean, Welsh doesn't get it in the end, but, I mean, Scott Bain gets it, so. Welsh with a lob over. Yeah. Can't get it to a Yeti, but Turnbull will get it to Rogic, who scored the goal. Passes it straight to St Mirren player, but Welsh does well to defend it well. Mental health is Welsh's team, he's a player. Jesus, ref, he nearly took about two yards for that throw in there. Logic. We'll go over to Christopher Ayer. Scott Bain hoofs it up the park. Edward headers it. McGregor. Rogic, good, good bit of play from Celtic. John Joe Kenny. Mm, nearly gets it to Turnbull, but unlucky on the turn. Unlucky. Unlucky? Truly really decent de do you think that we can, like, make sure we don't concede and your scoreboard becomes the reality? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just watching back this, the Roger goals. So a beauty, a beauty goal. That's his favourite. That's his favourite Roger on the curl. Um, to be honest, Lewis, we can't keep a clean sheet. But if we stick to the way we played against, obviously, uh, Mullerwell for the sixty minutes before we conceded, I say we can get another a victory. But it depends. All oh, depends. You know. I'll get that. Yeah, lovely okay. back. Lovely. Lovely play. We're get, you know, we're defending well now. We're, I think we've got a rhythm in the yeah. game. It's like when you score a goal, um, you get into the game. That was a horrible touch there from Edward, but, you know. I watched the Man United game last night. My stream cut out when I was doing the watch along. And I watched it when McTominay scored. Man United went in a, a rhythm. Because they had the, the best yeah. player. They had their first team player. Uh, West Ham. Uh, FA Cup. Edward now. Edward. Edward takes a free cat to Celtic. Yes, ref. Yes, ref. Free cat to Celtic, yeah? Yes, ref. Yes, ref. In fact, Lewis Tottenham when Everton are playing uh, FA Cup. Hmm. Here comes a Yeti. Edward. A Yeti. Oh, nearly. Good link up play there. Very good link up play. A Yeti and Edward. No fella, yes referee, sit down St Mirren, sit down, referee's on our side tonight. McGregor. Ah yeah, we're playing a bit of football now once we've got a, a lead. It's, it's horrible that I would say that we have to score first to get a bit of play into our game, but yeah. here comes Celtic again. Taylor, I think it's Taylor, I can't really see. Oh, it's a horrible pass from, I think it was Taylor or McGregor, I don't know who. Here comes St Mirren. Jesus. Oh, well done, John o When done, John o John Joe Kenny. I definitely think it depends, obviously, on how much Everton want for John Joe Kenny. I think he's like, definitely a player, I would say, a right back position, decent for Celtic. Because then you can put. Yeah, then, yeah, because then you can move um, Ayer back into that centre back role. You know, yeah. it's good. Um, yeah. Edward. Ayer is not very good at right back. Oh, he's class at it, but I would keep him at centre back because he has to defend well. Yeah, like, he's good, but, like... McGregor. You'd much rather have him at, uh, at centre back. Oh, referee, yes, I felt it's Celtic, but referee plays on you. Taylor crosses it in. Edward can't get it for him. Here comes St Mirren. Good block from Tom Rogic. And he'll find his way back to David Turnbull. Scott Brown. Yeah, I'll be back in a second. I hope I don't have to score. Welsh. Kenny. Ayer. Brown. Welsh. You see the last time it's possession there. 83% now for Celtic. Wasn't that in the first... 10 minutes of the game, but now we've got a bit of rhythm. We've got a bit of rhythm in our game now. Brown. 
we'll play it to Christopher Ayer. Oh, that's a good play. Oh, unlucky. We'll be a throw into Celtic. We better mix up with the, the St. Mirren keeper in the defence. Good play. Got to say, good play. Nearly getting there, Edward and a Yeti getting link up. Could be a potential link up for the end of the season. Throw in. A Yeti. It's crossed in. Kenny shoots. Jesus, miles off target. We're nearly, I think it goes at the stadium. <laughs> St. Mirren Stadium, I don't know. But it's, un it's unlucky. I, I would say it's unlucky from South there. Good, good play. A Yeti here. Good link up play, Edward. Oh, he nearly gets it, a Yeti. That a good defending from St. Mirren there. He lay it off. Look at that. Lovely. A Yeti. Oh, he's getting there to a Yeti, but unlucky. Good defending. Welsh. Good defending from Celtic. That's horrible from Edward. Horrible. I have returned. Okay, you've not missed it. Celtic had a chance, but. Oh, what's the referee doing? Hold on, hold on. He's give a foul to Celtic, I think, but what's happening here? Referee's going over. I don't know what's happening. Oh, come on, get up. You never touched him. Let's see here. Brown goes in for the tackle. Oh, I don't know. Oh, God. Has the assistant seen something? I don't know. Oh, please don't tell me it's a St. Mirren free kick, is it? That is. Oh, God. Is it? Is he going to book him? Oh, God almighty, it's a St. Mirren free kick. Oh. It's just worse than a bloody... Pe it's, like, it's just the same as a penalty for Celtic now. Like, Celtic fans, man. It's bloody nerve-wracking, man, because it's, it's, we're horrible at set pieces. Look at this. I mean, we clear it. That's lovely clearance. Here comes Celtic now in the attack. We're hopeless at attacking as well, by the way, on the break. I mean, let's just tell you that. <laughs> Ayer. He boots it up the park. It will fall to Eddie. Eddie, get a good touch on it. Go on, Edward. Go on. Go on, Eddie. Oh, you... Edward, you... you like, the way you're playing, man, it's like you've been out in international duty for a while, man. It's not like you've been... You know, he's been playing. You know, it's not like you've been subbed. You know, he's been training and everything. Ugh. 25 minutes gone here at, in Paisley. It's St Mirren nil, Celtic 1, thanks to Tom Rogic's opener. Lovely goal from Tom Rogic. We've played, I'll say not bad. We've not played, we've played not bad. That's what I'm Celtic's getting. Need to find out. They're in the, yeah, they're, they're in the lead. Good. Yeah. But 1 0 leads didn't win, doesn't win you games. I'll tell you that for starters. Yeah. Oh, there's a surprise. Look, Neil Lennon and John Kenny, they're out their seats. So, there's a surprise. Not uh, there's that's a surprise because it's a shock because they hardly out their seat. Mm. Here comes well in from Brown, good defending. Rogic. Now we're on the attack. Oh, unlucky Rogic. It was a horrible pass from McGregor. You know there was two men, two men, two men in front. Uh, you know beside Rogic, so there was hardly going to get out. Oh. The minute that's a, a weird, a poor ball from the minute and Scott Bain will just pick up. Um, so yeah, mm, Welsh John Joe Kenny will pass it back to Bain. Right, for all I want to see United is good football, right? I don't want to see like a Liverpool or an Allison moment, right? <laughs> oh, referee has a foul, yes, a uh, foul on. It will be a free kick at Celtic. It, will, it was a free, uh, Fraser for St Mirren um, filled Albion at Yeti. Ah, yeah. Pass it to Welsh. Roy, uh, Turnbull, sorry. Kenny. It will be a Celtic throw in. If you could pick one player in a whole world to bring to Celtic, 
Okay, Jeez, that's a hard one because Celtic need a bloody Celtic need a whole new team, but uh, see, uh, you know, if you asked that to any other person, you'd or they would probably say Messi or Ronaldo. But no, I wouldn't say that because one person doesn't change a bloody team, does it? Like I'm telling you, it doesn't for a reason. Celtic sign like three players, then they change our team. So, um, I'll bring in a good goalkeeper. I'll bring in a good goalkeeper. Nick Pope. That's what we're bringing. Nick Pope. I think he's tall and he's he's confident in goal. As long as he's got a confident back 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 line, that's his. That's a good defence for Celtic. Only if Celtic add thirty five million or whatever, uh, how much he's worth in the in the bank. Yeah. Um. If you ask me, I would I would also say we need a goalkeeper. But I don't think they're going to go in a Okay, who do you go? I don't think Dean Johnson is going to keep her that's bad. Out there, and obviously, maybe somebody who's good, but he's also somebody that's not going to. Yeah. So I think Dean Henderson for Man United. Hmm, good choice. That would be my second choice. I do like Dean Henderson. There was a. There was a. I put a video out like a couple of months ago. There was a part of a link between. Yeah. Uh, Celtic and Dean Henderson. Oh, yeah, but that was um, just a link. I don't, if it isn't Dean Henderson, it would be Liverpool, Calvin Kelleher. I don't know how to say it. But he's Irish and he's quite good. He was really good in the Champions League match mm. against Atlanta. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've seen that game, yeah. Apparently, he was really good. He got good comments there. Good, mm. good tackle from Taylor, good defending, all best sitting in the corner, though. Half an hour played, nearly half an hour played it. Here in the. I mean, this this game's going fast. I don't. One minute I'm, one minute I'm just starting the game and. Now one minute just typing kick off twenty minutes. The next minute it's half an hour through. It's cleared by Welsh. Well in from Welsh, cleared. Never a foul. Was that a foul to Celtic? What? Sit down, referee. Sit down. That's never a foul. Do you know what I know those fouls you, you see every day in a, in a football? I mean, that's a waste from a... A waste from St Mirren. It's one of those fouls you see every day in football, right? It's one of those... So if the slightest touch, a player goes down and hugs the ball, and the referee thinks, that's a free kick. Welsh. Higher. See that. We're playing not bad. We've got a wee bit ahead of them going. Mm. I won't be able to chat. Well, if I'm saying everybody's name, I won't be able to see everybody's name. So I'll just like, uh, Welsh over to Kenny. Come on, get a good. See if you get a second goal. It's not the comfortable yeah. lead, but it's a lead. Yeah, it's a lead. Oh, come yeah. on. Only one goal. Jesus Christ, St Mirren is... Oh, thank God, Taylor's there. Maybe bring Laxalt on the half. Yeah, I think we should bring Laxalt on the half. What? Oh, that's right. Right, what's the last one? I think at half time we should maybe bring on Laxalt to take on help or what? Yeah. We're going to put him on at West Park. Oh, what a ball. Alvin Ayeti, he's offside. I don't, I don't think he was offside. Lions would put slack up, I don't know. We'll look at it here, the replay. Let's see this. It looked like a good ball, I don't know who it was from. If it's going to show you the replay. Here we go, right, so. Ayeti. Oh, he's onside. He's onside a mile. What? What? Oh, come on. He's not offside. Hmm? Yeah, but it wasn't it wasn't outside. That's what I'm saying. Oh, McGregor wins it back. That's a foul to Celtic. Yep, free kick Celtic. We've played definitely a lot better than we did a few weeks ago at Celtic Park against St Mirren. That's embarrassing to say, but that is true. We've played better tonight. Edward. 
holds up the play a bit. Good, good bit of play. Turnbull. Rogic. Kenny. Rogic. Oh, nearly get nearly gets it through from Roger to Kenny, but unlucky. Oh god, oh god, Kenny's left that space. Oh god. Oh, gee. Oh, thank God, Saint Mary made the mistake. Here comes McGregor now. Turnbull. Welsh. Brown. Kenny. Roger now. Back to Brown. Is that your icon? Yeah, my icon centre-back. Hmm. How much are you putting them for? If, I, if he sells, if he sells, I'm going to be able to buy ninety one overall pair of checks. Oh. Who I've heard is quite good. Oh, has he turned into the icon now? Oh. Yeah, he's an icon now. Oh, I'm lucky I from I are jeez, I am now scored. He's got his skull cap and all. Jeez, that that just makes you feel old when you when you watch Peter Check actually play for Arsenal, my god. Jesus Christ. Does it feel like it was that long ago he It doesn't, it really doesn't. How much do you put him up for again? Which is where the prices he goes for about 200k. It's too random. People are always putting them at different prices. Welsh intercepts it. Goes straight to Eddie. Passes it to Brown now. Move forward. Come on. That's it. Goes to Tom Rogic now who opens the scoring and on the 16th minute mark. Here comes Rogic now. Rogic drives into the 18 yard box. Rogic. Oh, oh I tell like you what. Oh. Here comes St Mirren now. Bloody half our team's no, up the really park. Me. They can break St Mirren. Brown, just go for yeah. the bloody slide tackle. I don't care if you get booked, just go for it. <laughs> well in from Brown, well in. Mm. My cat, my cat's sitting up a stair in my bed because uh, the couch is obviously gone, so she's like, I have no idea where to go. She was pure confused last night when the snow was on, like, what's this stuff? Because she's hardly seen snow before, so. Oh. Okay, a, a little bit ago, I saw Stephen the Year in the world going for 300k. Oh, that's a steal. That's a steal. A bargain. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Stephen the Year in the world goes for about 500k. I thought he went for milk. I thought he went for milk. I'm going to save up and buy some of the other. I thought he went for millions, no? Is he, ba is he actually like, downgraded this year? Oh, yes, he is. 96 overall. I mean, I mean, it's not, that's not, that's good. He's got 90 tech, here's the stats. 95 diving, 94 handling, 98 kicking, 96 reflexes, 68 speed, 94 position. Not bad. Ten minutes to go till half time, guys. Uh, still win out Celtic. I've seen him go for as low as 470k just to mm. buy right away. So if I could sell for Resty, I already have it. Mm. Imagine if you could buy coins. Yeah. Would that just be overpowered? Yeah. That would be way too overpowered. Oh, yeah. Because I guess yeah. if people are... Yeah, if I could... Uh, who had hundreds of money, they would just buy the ultimate pack with the coins, of course, so, yeah. 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 But I wish there was a way I just easier... So sorry, listen, you go. Sorry. I was just going to say, if I sell Beresti, I can save up a bit just by playing a lot. Because I'm going to sell Beresti and I can afford it. Oh, that's a ref. That's a full ref. Ref. That is disgraceful ref. I'm going to be hard on me being pretty good. He would fit in my team to achieve me for the. Like I only have hundred, a hundred coins. I think <laughs> I spent my money on a um, couple of transfers. Oh, referee! Late one, Aaron Brown here. Edward. Rogic. Eh, Rogic, look where you're passing the ball, right? All right, you've scored, right? But look where you're passing the ball, please. 
Yeah. We, we win it back. Yeah. We're brown. And I've got Danny Ings anyway. Oh, Danny Ings is overpowered. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to play Zaha at striker if I'm not changing him to left front. McGregor. Zaha's quite good. Kenny. What the hell was that? What was that, Kenny? Left left one. Left Jesus, left McGregor. One. Thank God there's nobody in the stadium or he's a hit a person. <laughs> I'm going to play Danny Ings just to guarantee Innisfield. Maybe they play in. Oh, we've got another bloody nervous game on Sunday. We've got, we're away to St. Johnson. Oh, that's a bloody nervous yeah. game. We managed to... We scored in the 90th minute thanks to Lee Griffiths back in, back in October. And Patrick and Mauer after we scored. Hopefully Vardy sells, because I'm selling them for a bit on the market price and the rest of them. I just hope he sells, because... I mean, see, I'm, I would kill for Team of the Year now. I'm going to miss a bit on squad battles. I don't know what I was going to say. I wish, I wish there was an easier way to get coins. I know that I know you can get easy ways, yeah. but come on, like... Like, if you're just new to new to like FIFA and you want to get coins to get a good team, you know what I mean? Yeah. I, I I'm just thinking of squad balls and like, oh, Ninety, Messi, flashback Ronaldo and Pedro. It's a very squad. Hmm. What, is Messi like the 12th man of the team of year? Yeah, 12th man of the team of year, 90 overall. I think him and Lewandowski, if I'm correct, are tied for best player on FIFA mm. It was always going to be known that Messi was going to be the 12th man. When when Messi wasn't announced oh, on the... Like, see, when Messi wasn't announced on oh, the team of the years, like the, you know, uh, the 11, it was always yeah. going to be announced that Messi was going to have one. It's always, it's always going to be. Until you Messi... Know, honestly, I'm just surprised Neymar wasn't the 12th man. Mm, yeah. Obviously it was a vote, but like Neymar, I thought would be guaranteed because of how OP he is this year. We're doing some bloody Man United stuff here, bloody passing it back and forth with the defence. But we've got it here, we've got it, we've got it upfield, it's fine. But we're going bloody back away, my god. Uh. Tell me, what would you do if you just went to play a match with me? You see my team and I've got team the year nowhere. I mean, I, I would say I have Nick Pope, you have... Nothing against me. <laughs> I, I might, I might not score against you, but I mean, I, you might, you're not gonna score against me. Honestly, though, see if you had three of each Nick Pope. Oh my God! You know, I've just thought. Imagine a three of your Nick Pope, or even a team of the season so far, Nick Pope. Oh, uh, yet he's not happy with the, with the, the referee. He's saying that he's, he's, he's fouled him too many times. I mean, he has. I mean, that's good play from a Yeti, but this guy keeps fouling him. He comes to McGregor with speed. Kenny. I'm on to me, though. We've got to get proper tackles. Right, okay, my 7th, 8th rate goalkeeper is really good, surprisingly. Hmm, who is Olsen, it? Swedish. Oh. Uh, Olsen. Not bad, not bad. He's, he's really good in real life. See that Liverpool one, yeah? Oh, uh, what? My well, Olsen plays for Everton. Oh, here comes a Yeti. <laughs> He basically saved him in the Leeds match, making three saves in a row. Oh, it was Rogic, sorry. Ooh, I thought it was a Yeti I was, uh, trying to shoot it, it was Rogic. Uh, oh, it takes I'm a deflection. Go on a kick. player who plays in the Turkish league, Fernando mm -hmm. Mestreira, got a team of the week. Yeah. Um, Celtic have a corner now. It'll be David Turnbull to take a corner. Come on, get Stevie Welsh on this. Get Stephen Welsh on the header. Five minutes to go till half time. Come on. Come on, the Welsh. Come on. Crosses in. Oh, keeper drops it. Oh. Rogic picks it up. Come on, cross it in. Falls to Brown. Oh, it's, it's cleared. That was a good body. That was a good cross. Wait, what would, if somebody asked you what Turkish team do you support, what would your answer be? Oh, what? what I, don't, I can't remember what Turkish teams they have. Like, I would just say Galatasaray, because Muslera. Oh. Oh, it's a nice... I don't even know if that's how you say his name. He's Uruguayan. Mm. Unlucky from David Turnbull. And it's the most random reason ever. It's because on PES 2020, he saved me so many times.
time and he's like the first goalkeeper player ever got. So I was able to get him and so I said thank you to you and see if you can help me with the game sometime. And that's how I ended up with Mishoya. I'm one of my favourite goalkeepers. Welsh wins it again. Four million eighty two for all thirty four, so Yeah. So if nothing else, he's a cheap goalkeeper for a premium mode. You know what you should do? You should. They're probably not even good on FIFA, but it's a, it's a rip off. But FIFA should bring out a good, good Celtic players like, like, like good stats and where they are, and like you should yeah. build a team and Wales should be on it, like ultimate team of the week. Yeah. There should be more flashback cards that are just worse versions of a current player. That'd be hilarious. That'd be, that would actually be funny. No, I want a flashback card of Messi in his early days and it'd be a unique card because oh. it'd have his long hair and game and all. Jesus Christ, thank you, John Joe Ke- <laughs> Thank you, John Joe Kenny. Thank you. It was a bloody goal for St Mirren and what a tackle from John Joe Kenny. The defence for Celtic is atrocious. I mean, it's Man United defending all over the place. John Joe Kenny slides in, right, he gets it right or else it's a penalty, you know? Lovely oh. tackle. Oh, I don't even know if he gets... He doesn't get the ball, so it's not a corner. Oh, thank God. Yes. John Joe Kenny, the ultimate... Anyway, as I was... Anyway, so as I was saying, it would be a unique card because this special Messi flashback would have long hair Messi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, Pez has a special long hair Messi card. Yeah. So what about FIFA? Yeah, I might not say he's like in five minutes. Edward McGregor over the top. Oh, what a ball it was to. Oh, iron out. So go back to your keeper. Go back to keeper. Anyway. Right on you go. Sorry. So, what I've got so far is Celtic are playing well, but we, we just can't score, finish our chances. We've won, well, right, so, we've got one goal, right, which is good, right, but our defence is still shaky and shocking, right? Um. Even though we've got Welsh and Ayer there. Um, you know, getting forward's easy, but we, we can't put it in the bloody net. That's that's what's cost us this season. See the 78-minute goalkeeper? He's the next... He's the Swedish Nick Pope of FIFA. The man's just saved something that I thought would be guaranteed a goal with his feet. <laughs> he's the Swedish Nick Pope of FIFA. Edward turns the def- defence of St like a rap. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's behind what they are yet to. Make him sit What happened? Aaron accidentally deleted GTA 5. Ooh. Um, doesn't, doesn't that take uh, ages to download? No. It takes blood ages to download. Oof. Even on the PS5. There will be two minutes added on of the first half. Celtic winning 1 0 thanks to Tom Logic. But here comes St. Mirren. Oh my bloody thank you, Stevie Welsh. Oh, it's Christopher Iyer, sorry. Thank you, Christopher Iyer, who clears it. Or else it would have been a goal to St. Mirren. So there you go. Lovely from Christopher. Good defending, but I don't know where I defend it. I don't I don't know where our defence is. I really don't. Like, I don't I'm struggling to see where our defending is. I really, I, I really don't. I'm struggling to see it. Yeah, uh, sorry if I'm not talking a lot. That's alright, sorry. sorry. I know you're playing, so you have to focus. So it's just, it's just shocking. Oh, oh, it's going to be a Le- Levinson bloody throwing in it because it's one name. I say Levinson throwing because Jesus bloody Christ! You know them long throw-ins that Levinson used to do. Uh-huh. Oh, thank God it's not throw. Uh-huh. Right, Levinson do them all the time, and Celt- uh, Levinson scored against Celtic all the time against them, and they nearly did again. But it was a foul, um, high boot on McGregor, so, so, um, it'll be a foul free kick to Celtic. Uh, what, like, 30, 20 seconds to go till half time here. Celtic are winning. I mean, I would give it still to John. I would still give it to John Goodwin because he stopped Celtic from scoring about two goals or three goals before half time. So, yeah, I'll give it to him. They're still in the game. It's only one 0 down. You know. That ball, yeah, it could always be 
What? I mean, Edward's just a waste of space in the foot. Oh! There's no need for that, pal. Alright, it's a free kit to sit in, but you don't need to shove Edward like that. There's no need. He's walking past you. No need for it. No need for it at all. He should be booked, ref. He should be booked. I mean, bloody. What spell would you take off? And what would you put on a replacement um, so far? Oh, God. Uh, I would put... Can you hear me? Yeah, I can. I don't, I don't know who I'd put on. I really don't. Welsh clears it. St. Mirren's still in the box. The block. It's surely blow for half-time, ref. It, yes, you? it's half-time, yes. Can you hear me, yeah? Uh, yeah, I can hear you. It's... Oh, sorry. It's half-time... Uh, Paisley, it's St Mirren now, Celtic 1, thanks to Tom Rodgers, goal, um, so yeah. If you had say would you take off right now and who would you bring on? Who would I take off and who would I bring on, right, um, I would take off, oh, that's a toughie. I don't know because our team's doing not bad, but I would bring on El Yunusi for, hmm, one of midfielders, I don't know who. I'll just bring one for my midfielders. You know, I wonder what goals Willie Pedley truly thought goals he's replaced. What? I wonder what goals Willie Pedley truly thought. Obviously, Hazard, he's probably our best one this season. Yeah, definitely. He won as a good triple treble. I wonder why he doesn't play. I really don't know, like, maybe because he's youth, I don't know, I really don't, but he's better than Bloody he's still better than Dave. He's better than what we've got, I'll tell you that, he's better than what we've got. Yeah, like, even if he's youth, just play him better for them. A player being youth as an unexcused to not play them even after they could, it just means they, they'll get good experience. There we go, fit it all in. So it's South Mirren now, South at 1, thanks to Tom Rogers' goal at half time. Um, really the half time was shocking, uh, the first half sorry was shocking until we scored in this 15th minute and then we got a bit of, you know, possession, you know, got a bit of play, got a bit of rhythm and then we, you know, we, you know, really didn't really do it and set from that, that was it, that was the, the moment of the half I would say, the goal. What well, are your three things we've learned so far? Obviously, it doesn't have to be all three. Well, the first thing we learned is our defence is still disgraceful. Um, we cannot attack. We cannot tackle. Yeah, our full backs are very bad, but our centre backs are very good. Um, we can we can break. We can we can hardly break teams down. You know, it's like it's like um. Got it's like we go we go forward. Somehow we can't, and it's like the final piece of your work, you can't get it done. It's like that. You can't shoot, they can't get the goal. But they got the goal just now anyway, but it was a lovely finish. How does he have hair? He's bald. <laughs> can't this one, um, Angelino we plays for, are we? Oh, uh, yeah. Extra? He's bald. Yeah, he's like, yeah, he doesn't have any hair at all yet. For right now, he's got a full head of hair. <laughs> Oh, that's silly. That is good. So, my, so far, my prediction is got, coming true. Lewis's prediction is 2-1. <laughs> so, yeah, our full backs are really good for our centre-backs. Mm, second thing, really, as I said, we, can't, we, can, we can break teams... We can, you know, it's... We can hardly break teams down where we can't get the final touch on uh, scoring. And that's it. Uh, and I can't get um, the third thing. Oh, I was just saying, the three things we've learned so far, it doesn't have to be like... Yeah, I know, I was just saying that's what I thought in the first half. Even on his cud picture, he's not got any hair. And yet he's playing in the game, he's got a head full of it. Oh man, what a FIFA game. <laughs> FIFA, the only game where the bald players are going to have heads. The, the bald, the bald cretin, the bald cretin. <laughs> oh, I not, he's bald, but he's, he's literally got a full head of his hair. No, I, I paid, where I didn't pay 
that took on first game. I paid forty pounds for the most expensive edition. But like I paid forty pounds for this game. It's not forty pounds for a bald man to have a full head of hair on people. Uh Jesus, the last time Notre Dame posted on their Twitter was 2nd of June. To be fair though, there isn't much to post. Considering all the rules and you can't really do anything. Oh my god, my life is suspended. To be fair, I've been suspended. No, no. Because the people office are playing for. Do you remember the Warrior Games? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we were meant to do them, and yet we just never did. Yes. Yeah. You get folks talking about the Warrior Games, and yet nothing ever happens. Then. I've got a notification. Yes. Cindy got original light to my posts. They like this one, the windbreak. See, I got because I got their their windbreaker coat, yeah. and I tagged them in it because it, it looks it's nice. I I walked out part late today, and it's it was like yeah. my mum said it was it was freezing. I couldn't feel it in, because of the the coat. So yes. You know that sounds like a really well timed ad sponsor, <laughs> but nah, you would never get sponsored yet. Oh, they've got. What was it, Park Please? I'm gonna guess the pictures that somebody's phone. Well, they're not actually open. They were actually fixing the fences and well, me yeah. the park. So you can't you can't actually get in the, the fields now. The pictures, sorry, the ones we got they we got into um in like the summer. Yeah. Oh well, we did find another place that's just about yeah. equally as good. As I was saying, they've brought out um the place I got the windbreaker. They've brought out beanies. Mm. Seems mm. everywhere bring bring out mm. beanies, like hats. You know, for I just really do not like wearing hats. Hmm. I don't know why. I just do not like them. It's the most it's it's the stupidest thing ever. I know. I just don't like to wear hats. Wait, why can't I just go up my tag? No, please not go into my eye called Blinge. Well, I'm gonna see if... I don't know if I'm... Oh, I'm gonna see what phone cases they have. Who? Syndicate. Oh, they don't have any phone... I don't... I don't... Do they have phone cases? Yeah. What? Who knows, but we'll find out. I don't think they do. If you go to the bottom of the page, wait, if you go bot, wait, they've got backgrounds for your phone, that's all. No, they don't have phone cases. See, if you search up on, if you search up on Google Syndicate, Syndicate Original Phone Case, right, I don't know if they'll have yours, of course, um, and if you go, if the website's called Deck, Deck, I guess. Um, oh, okay. Oh, this one. This is a syndicate. This is. No, these are syndicate ones. These are really good website. It's Deca. Decalgirl dot com. Oh, it says. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Can you hear me? Yeah, can you hear me? Yes. Oh, suddenly you went very quiet. As I was saying, it's called Deca Deco Girl. So if you search up Syndicate Original f um, Phone Cases, there's a website called that. So oh, you choose your oh, design. Now I'm looking at different things. Okay, sorry. I'm choose that. Oh, I want to see if they've got oh. your phone. Code. Okay, case code. Okay, okay right, this looks like my phone. They have not got your phone case. 
Apple iPhone 12 Pro Max. Oh no, no, that's a home. Oh no. What about you? Uh, no, I don't want Blizzard. iPhone 12 Mini Pro. You're still gaming? Yes, 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 yes. Oh, that's good. Mm, what image do you use? Um, nothing. So for the shoes, that image of a brick. <laughs> a brick phone case, that's done. That's done, yeah. Oh! It's really thin bit. This Actually, phone case know, looks this. amazing. Jesus Christ. Okay. What? Look at this. I'm going to be right now. <laughs> a brick phone case. Um, this phone case, man, it's $25, which is, what the hell's $25? So it's $25, which is £18. Mm, not bad. It's not bad, it's not bad. Right. I think the second half starting in a minute. Oh my god. Uh, just the next time you next time I see you you'll be like you like my new phone case, it's a brick. <laughs> I'll be like, your phone is not a brick loans. That is I, that's gonna be mad. Yeah, I don't plan on getting that. Uh, That'd be mad. <laughs> I'd be mad. Man, one of a sudden I'm just streaming, you know, or I'm. Um, and I'm saying, what you got? What you got a brick in your hand, Morris? You gonna hit at me? <laughs> oh. um. One minute I'm streaming here with you, like a football manager or something. It's it's yeah. light. It's pitch black now. I know it's nine o'clock, but like, come on. Jeez, it only felt like Monday where I would just started and um, like the half term break. And now it's bloody, we're back to bloody school tomorrow. Like, you know what I mean by school? It's like online school. Yeah. Sounds like school, like where we're going to school, but we're not. <laughs> online school. Do, 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 do. Is that it? Uh, hopefully, there's no online classes tomorrow. <laughs> Galaxy S21, Jesus Christ. Three cameras, Jesus. It looks like a, that's a thick phone. And buy today and claim the Galaxy Buds as well. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, dodgy sites. Oh. Dodgy sites. <laughs> dodgy sites for Lewis. I'm only joking, eBay is a good site. Depends on what else you're getting. Uh, mm. What are you looking for? Phone cases on it? Yeah. What type of phone case are you looking for in there? Um, search up. I've got a Motorola 1 version 4. Right. Yeah, but so like. Just but just a, ra just a random one, yeah? Here we go, it's second half starting. Here we go. Oh. Team's back up. Ugh. See any, see any you like us now? I found one and it's free and that seam as the one that the phone comes with. It's just a free or see through one. Ah. Uh. 
If I was a more famous YouTuber and I, you, I was getting paid for it, I would do a video where, um, what do you call it? You have like five minutes to buy how much you, how, how much, mm. however you want, how much ever you want, right? <laughs> Here we go. Second half, Lewis. Lewis's prediction still say is subject to something one. Mine's one else said it was currently. Um, low Lewis's looks a bit more likely, but I don't know. We'll find out. Second half is starting now. Here we go. Any others there? Are you still lose now? No, I'm going for the fight away. Mm. It's basically just, literally just the same on my phone. Oh. Hey, at least your phone, your phone comes with a case. That always doesn't. <laughs> that was just comes with oh, a screen protector. It's, it's literally just one of the ones that you can buy for two pounds anyway. Ah, that's right, okay. Mm. Clear, see-through. I mean, something. That's good to start you off as a case if you're looking, if you're still searching for one. Well, it's decent enough considering it comes with the phone for free. Okay, I got. Doesn't look. We yeah, have not made any changes. I was a wild. I mean, I mean, he had a shot, Samarin, but it was wild off target. Well, off target. Sorry. Jesus, we're getting, we're bumping in each other, like, anything. Right, here comes Celtic now. Edward, Taylor, Turnbull, back to Christopher Ayer. McGregor. Oh. Welsh. What sort of phone case you look? I, I think I said this before, but what sort of phone case you look for again? Just a decent one. Yeah, something that will last your phone. Yeah. Yeah, one that does. Basically, one that has is a decent. But like, it's like one that you could get for like one pound out of any shop. Ah. Here comes Christopher Iyer running forward. Rogic, Turnbull, Edward. Edward shoots is blocked. Oh. So far, the closest thing I've seen to my phone is the Moto G8. Hmm. Yeah, it I've seen. the exact same. But obviously, it's not, is it? Hmm. Is that the one that's only got three cameras and it's the flashes at the bottom? Oh, no, it's got the exact same one on it. Huh. Yeah. I wonder what the difference is size in, maybe size. Maybe. I would guess size then if it's called. Because if I go into my settings, my system, about phone settings, mm. it's the exact same as the You, why is our defence so bad? We let free kicks like that. It is. Who is that? A beaker of bloody. I mean. Aye, there's no need for it. He's born bloody neighbour. He's oh. ever going to cross this or shoot it. Either way, he could get it in because we've got bloody small bloody Peppa Pig and go. Bloody Scott Bain. Oh. Uh, a funny moment in Mark Goldberg's where they, they're losing to Burnley and um, it turns over to Peppa Pig and he, he said, I'd rather watch Peppa Pig and watch us. <laughs> that was hilarious. Have you watched Mark? Oh, uh, have you watched Mark Goldbridge's vlogs? Like, eh? oh my god, it's hilarious. Wait, Mark Goldbridge has vlogs. Yeah, if you just search up Mark Goldbridge, um, that's his main channel. I've never these and he teaches his kids to say what happens. What do we do when Bruno scores for United? And they say get in. And what do they, what do we do when Liverpool score? 
get out. Jesus, good, good block. Well, and uh, that's what I was supposed to do. Block it, that's what. He's offside. That's well kept from Scott Bain. Oh, it's hilarious. I, if you just search up Mark Goldbridge, it's on his main channel. Um, I'll search up where. Well, McGregor. Who's that, McGregor? Edward was facing the other way, but he wasn't expecting it. I yet to try to run on it. You will get it. I yet to. Who's that? Taylor. Back to McGregor. Turnbull. I was trying to get that Celtic uh, second goal. Edward. Rogic. Kenny. Ayer. Uh, Ayer or Welsh, I don't know who. Can you see it? Rogic. Kenny. McGregor. Rogic. Kenny. Brown. Ayer. Ayer now moving forward. Go on, Turnbull. Go on. Taylor. McGregor. What the hell is like? St. Mirren are all backs to the bloody wall. Here comes Ayer. Oh, he nearly gets there. Nearly gets there, Ayer. We'll be a throw into Celtic, though. Bloody Ayer's nearly a bit striker. <laughs> Because oh. he's that tall, I don't think anybody actually wants to tackle him because they'll, they'll just push him out of the way. Like, woof. Everyone thought that about Shane Duffy, and Shane Duffy's just the opposite. <laughs> Shane Duffy's running away from me. <laughs> <laughs> Taylor. Man, could he catch up with a screen? <laughs> we have another throw in yet. Why don't we practice at training long throw ins? I've seen a lot of teams do it, but we don't do it. I don't know why. We've got bloody tall players and we don't do it. That's what annoys me a bit. Come on, Taylor, throw it. See, that's what you should have passed it to. Oh, Brown. Rogic. Kenny. Brown. McGregor. Taylor, Ayeti, Taylor, Tumble will get it. This is just like my football magic here, it's just back and forward, back and forward. Brown now. Kenny on the right hand side, cross it. Oh, I don't think that is Kenny, that's too tall for Kenny, I don't think. Mm. Pass it to McGregor, pass it to McGregor, hit it McGregor. Oh, you, you had it too wide. That's oh, my like it's it though. Still yeah, but well, still one to sell it. But we're pressing for that. We're pressing for that um, second goal. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's just wide. We should. You know, McGregor. He's unlucky there. So he's unlucky. Punts up the park. Ball states man. Well, uh, I will get that. I why are you heeding it out the? I mean, it's a safe option, like you know, if you're ever in doubt. But like, put it up the yeah. park. Put it up the St. Mirren's end, you know. But you know, it's alright. I've been saying that I'll give all three points. Well, I hundred, you can get for one pound. Oh. That I'm gonna buy a mobile game called Football Aid. Are you well? Football, yeah. Like, come on, get it out of the bloody our half. Come on, Eddie. Oh, Jesus, Eddie, your touch is half a date. I'll tell you that. Need to practice your touch. Ah, uh, yes, well in, Davy. Well in. <clears throat> see, if you set, see if Celtic get the second goal, they can settle back a wee bit, right? You know, you still got to watch for St. Mirren. Imagine though if you save up to see them Google points, right? Yeah. If you got that pound, imagine if you could actually spend it on like real like like real things like eBay or something. Like yeah. then again then again, that would be probably too too far. Google yeah. too. But I guess more people would buy like the 
you know, Android phones if that was, a, you know, a thing. Oh, good ball. Go on, Kenny. Dad, the way that everyone is, for Example, the example the example of 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 the Turnbull. Oh, Turnbull. Oh, he blocks it. Brown. Had it, Brown. Go on. Logic. Oh, he bloody blocked. I've got about. Sit, man, I've got about 10 men behind that. Oh, God. Oh, thank God. That ball's too far. And Bane will get it. I'm Jesus. just going to spin on the transfer list, you know, FIFA. Went for somebody to buy Fidesz or Vardy. I mean, I would buy Vardy if I had the coins, but. Yeah. Uh, Come on, put pressure the keeper. That's what we want. Pressure the keeper. That's it. Come on, come on, come on, Aya. Go on, Eddie. Go on, Eddie. Had it, Eddie. Yes. What? He's missed it. Who How's he missed it? Oh. How has he missed it? Oh my. I want to know how Edward's missed it. It's a simple tapping. Oh. Here comes, so it's Edward, he passes it to Rogic. I don't know how it's known 2 now. Rogic passes it in. Eddie. I think it, no wait, does it take a deflection? Oh. Let's see this, Edward. It does. I think it does, does it? I don't know. Oh, he's, the referees give a corner, I don't think it touches, I don't touches anybody, but Edward's missed an absolute oh sitter. God. It is a corner to Celtic, but that's an absolute sitter from Edward. It doesn't look like he's touched anybody. And the history of short corners, Short corners never work in the bloody years. It's proven, right? It's proven in the history of years, short corners don't work. So why does football do it? That's the question everybody asks. Taylor, um, Taylor or Yeti, it's a Yeti. Does well, a Yeti, that's a foul. He's tugging his shirt, ref. He'll play on, though. Taylor. That should have been 2 0 Celtic, but. <sighs> Missed opportunity. No, you know, it's one of them. Taylor, find space to Turnbull. McGregor, Turnbull. Shoots! Oh, good save from Anwick, but the keeper scrambles it. Oh, fall back to McGregor. Brown, out by to Greg Taylor now. Ayete. Turnbull. Has a pop again! Oh, corner kick. Good save from the keeper. We're getting, we're getting, we're getting shots away. That was a lovely, lovely shot from David Turnbull. We'll see it here. A Yeti passes it to Turnbull in space. And when Turnbull's got space, he'll shoot it. If Keeper doesn't actually touch, it takes a deflection. Yeah, it takes it. Oh, right, the first one, the Keeper saves it, but... Another corner itself to Turnbull to take it. Come on, Turnbull, he's a good cross. Come on, Welsh, come on, Welsh. It's in. Ah. Right, here comes Taylor. McGregor, Turnbull, McGregor, don't go back away, right, Mc Brown now, Jesus Christ, Brown, he's got it, Edward, Edward, he's done well, oh, he's done the hard part, Eddie, he's done the hard part, and he bloody skies it over the bar, he's done the hard part, look, he takes it down beautifully, I mean, the touch is, you know, I don't see an Look at that. Beats two men. Takes two men on and he beats them. He does him but the bad the hard part and then he, he just skies it and ends. You know, he could have crossed it and you know, right across the goal and it could have been anybody to touch it, but here come bloody St. Mirren. Jesus Christ. Oh thank God. Turnbull. Brown. It feels like sometimes or away kit sometimes dodgy, like a, a, a jinx sometimes. It just feels like that. Sometimes Welsh clears it. Okay, anyway. And our play that Paisley 
Is it Madden now Celtic 1 now? Does it feel like bloody we've, we've already played 60 minutes of the game? I know we've had half time, but... That's far too easy. That is far too easy. I know the, the ball didn't go out of play. Here comes it. Rogic now. Pass it. Pass it to a Yeti. You... Why did you do that, Rogic? Why didn't you pass it to Rogic? You bloody... Why has he done that? Why has he done that? Bloody lovely pass. Why didn't you pass to a Yeti? A Yeti's screaming for it and you bloody put it wide. I wouldn't care if you... I wouldn't care if you scored, Rogic, but you bloody missed it. He's bloody missed it. He's not even wearing the pink boots, so I couldn't even see the pink boots. And Lenny's just sat back in his chair saying, what am I going to watch tonight? <laughs> That's the way his face is, though. It's like, no, stand up there. Ah. Uh, still looking for a phone case, Lewis? No. Oh, no, I gave up. Ah, gave up. Here comes Brown. Turnbull. Still waiting on somebody to buy your your, your FIFA, your Beresi. Yep. And Vardy. Yep, I'm a Vardy. That press will get me quite close to being a team in the other way. Edward. McGregor. Like, Edward's coming back, like, nearly midfield just to get a touch the ball. You know, that's how sometimes I feel about the game. Like, if Edward's not getting a touch the ball, he'll yeah. come back. But that's how I just feel the game. Like, sometimes we can't even get it through to the strikers. But... Yeah. We've had a bit of chance. You know, is it going to be these one of these nights where missed opportunities, you know, defies our night, you know? Or, you know, we'll see what happens. Mm. Mm. Brown now. We're moving the ball well, I'll tell you what. We've, we've played a lot better than the, the start of the first half, i tell you that. That Roderick, that is. Edward. Roderick. Over to Greg Taylor now. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, Taylor. Who's that? Man, when people say he can't cross a ball, I mean he can't cross a ball. <laughs> and we'll get it back again. McGregor. Brown. Kenny. Don't go back the way. Go forward. Jesus Christ. I think somebody needs... Len is not saying it, you know. Why is anybody else saying it? See, Roderick, that's what you get for doing fancy skill moves. You get dispossessed because St Mirren just do that. They like to dispossess people who do fancy skills. Yeah. So if even bloody Neymar does skills, St Mirren will probably just still dispossess. Oh, come on, ref. The ball was kept in. Oh. That was all thanks to Roderick with his stupid skill moves. And also, Edward, he takes far too many touches, you know, when he can shoot and it's going to be a goal. You know, like... He wants to be one of those heroes like Neymar. He wants to score one of the bloody cracker of goals. Like, just shoot the ball and it's a bloody goal. <sighs> oh, it's a free kick. Yes, referee. Sit down, St. Mirren. Sit down. The only thing that I can't get on that Mark Goldbridge has is a timer, you know, for the game. I tried to get it on, but it wouldn't let me. It wouldn't let me go up to like forty-five minutes per half. Only like, only let me go up to twenty minutes. I was like, must be American <laughs> for the soccer, yeah. for the um, the, like the oh, American football. Football. Jesus, the slack passes were bloody made tonight. Two minutes of play, and then Two minutes of play. Oh yeah, that's just. I just feel that's a whole American TV ads. <laughs> yeah. That's a booking ref. Baseball is like five other sports or something. Yeah. Uh, it will be a booking as a sore one on Welsh. He's, well, it looks like he's crying Welsh. Sore one. Oh, that's a red card. He stands on his boots. That is a sore one. That is a very sore one. Obika, you should be sent off, pal. That is a sore one. He, he, no attempt for the ball. No attempt for the ball when he stands on his his, his feet. That's a sore one. A very sore one for Welsh. Don't know if it... Oh, God almighty. Lewis, guess he'll be coming on if he can't continue. What? Bloody Duffy. <laughs> <laughs> He's our only bloody centre-back on the bench. 
That's a late, a definitely a late one on Welsh. That's a solo. Come on, Welsh, fight your bloody, fight the soreness. Come on. Uh, all I can see is play Greg Taylor at centre back. Ben Laxalt on at left back. I feel like so. He's not. He, oh, oh God, Duffy's at bloody training. Oh God. Oh. I feel like so. Or is he? Oh, I didn't mean that. Oh well. Oh. <laughs> Mac and George as well. Uh, I'll, I'll get it in a minute. Um, I feel like. Oh, Ryan Christie's coming on. Ryan Christie's coming on for Celtic. Uh, Twenty-five minutes to play. Um, Paisley, Christie be coming on. I don't know who for. It better not be for Turnbull. If it's Turnbull. That's just defies lining. That just defies lining yeah. at the finest. So I think it'll, it'll be either Rogic, Rogic coming off, or um, who's on? Rogic or McGregor, I would say. I don't know. Or Brown. Could be Brown, I don't know. You switch to the captain to, oh, God almighty, no. They're bringing the bloody crutches on. The stretchers on for Welsh. Oh, no. No. Oh, God almighty. Duffy has to come on. I think he's broke his I think he's broke his ankle. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh. Our season's over again. Oh god. I think he's he's either he's either um dislocated his ankle or done something to his leg because oh god almighty. Oh god. Big big mm. balloon, big duffy. Oh god. Yes. It's my worst nightmare. It's like something you bloody see in your nightmares. Oh, it's like bloody ha- It's like bloody Harry Maguire playing for bloody United. Oh, God. Yeah, it's exactly my nightmare. Karim Bell Rabbit on FIFA <laughs> with Nick Hopkins. <laughs> I mean, that is. Oh, my God. It looks like he's dislocated his ankle. That. Or his foot. Like, he stands right. See the bone of your foot? Like, there. Yeah. That's where he stands on it, where he studs. Yeah. That is a sore one. Oh, my God. I mean, they're bringing on hundreds of stuff, like the stretchers, the bloody art, the orange stuff. Jesus Christ. Oh, God almighty. Oh, God, Huffy Duffy. Oh, bloody Duffy, man. Please don't do any stupid daftness tonight. Lennon, just, just, I don't know. Oh, bloody Gavin Strachan with his bloody iPad outside. Do you want to play that? Do you want to bet on that guy? So, no, you know. Jesus Christ. Oh... Ryan Christie and Bloody Duffy, come on. I don't know who Ryan Christie's coming on for. But Welsh is getting stretched off. Hopefully he's alright in the end, but... Um... I don't... Oh, God, he'll be out for a while. That's another bloody injury list. Oh... We, oh we're only getting into a bloody rhythm with the bloody Welsh and Ayer. Now Ayer has to bloody babysit again. He's only bloody slept an hour. Oh, bloody hell. This is not a bloody Yeti. A bloody five-year-old can defend better than bloody Duffy, man. Shocking. And it's a Yeti coming off our um, Celtic, so he'll be switching formation. He's going to a 4 3 2 one Yeah, 4 3 2 one he's going. Six to seven minutes gone. Um, I guess over about three minutes I don't at the end of the game, but it mm-hmm. is a Yeti to come off for Celtic. Doesn't get his goal in Yeti, but he's game, put in some, a decent performance. <laughs> Compared to when, like, you know, back in September, you know. I'll give him it tonight. Yeah. We're going to have his buddy Duffy balls that, you know, what the players right there and he's going to huff it right at Bloody Paisley Park. But it probably had a bloody bus. <laughs> mm-hmm. This is going to be torture to watch these last um, 20 minutes of this game. This is going to be torture. Mm-hmm. Kenny, Ayer, players it. I mean, where's our bloody players? Who's up at park? Eddie's just standing there like, oh god. Ayer heads it. If we had two, if we were two now up, you know, I still wouldn't be the best, but you know, I'd have a wee bit of comfort. We're bloody only one now up. That's a Celtic ball, but oh god. I mean, he's tall, but he doesn't look bloody. No. He looks. Oh. Imagine, he he looks like he looks like a Terminator. He looks like Arnold Schwarzenegger, but he's actually not. Oh. He's the opposite. Jesus, come on, go forward. Yes, Rogic, pass it, Edward now, Edward. Rogic, oh, it's just too far from too far. 
Cross is in again. Keep Ar Arnwick will get Ar Arnwick gets it for St. Mirren. Keeper. It's lovely play. Roger gets it to Edward. Edward sees Roger in the box. Just a too too much too much power on the ball. And Roger just gets it to the keeper. Ah, uh, unlucky. Unlucky Celtic. I could have been 2 0 up. Much but more, but hey well. I remember when it was prime for like primary schools where your mm. birthday parties would be um the oh what's it called again? Fun world. Fun world. That was yeah. everybody's birthday party. Shut down now. I know it's that's that's, 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 that's funny your your childhood memory's gone. Mm. So is is laser ma so is laser matrix as well. I think that's shutting down as well. Mm. I've only been there once but I went with like eleven other people. It was pure fun. I fell about twelve twice, but I was hilarious. It was funny. It was fun. We need a yeah, second goal. <laughs> yeah, we need a second goal here, Celtics. St. Mirren are bringing on bloody attack. They're still going to go for it. Oh, God almighty. Why did we... Do you know what? I thought we should we take Brown off because then, you know, he's rested and we have a bit... Or Sorrow bring Sorrow, bring Sorrow on for... Still 1-0 Celtic, but I'm still not secure with us. I'm still not happy. I know we're winning one 0 but I'm still not happy with one 0 because one 0 one 0 to any other team in the world would be perfect, right? Who are on a great run, but to Celtic it's like a bloody nightmare. Yeah. To Celtic fans as well. Yeah. Here comes St. Mirren. Don't let him in your box. Taylor wins it back. Good. Taylor, don't just puff it up the park. Nobody's there except from Ryan Christie, who can hardly run for his life. Like if he's trying to run for his life, he can hardly. Roger, you're getting done by a bloody bloody. Guy it gets paid bloody I don't know fifty I don't know hundred k um less than a hundred k a week you're getting paid more than that and you're bloody hopeless. Oh. Roger just gets done. He gets sent back to bloody Australia there. Lucky it's blo oh guess who blocks it, Lewis? <laughs> bloody Huffy Duffy. He actually blocks a shot for once and it doesn't go in the back of the net. <laughs> there you go. And the substitution will be made for. Uh, so, uh, so it will be Dylan Connolly coming off for McPherson. Um, that looks like a striker or a midfielder. So they're going for it, St. Mirren. They're going for a drop. They've only lost. They've only last. They've only lost bloody twice so far in the last six games. So fair play to them for going for it. But here comes Roger wins it back. Roger pass it. Oh, we get a free kick. That's fine then. It's, a, it's another Celtic Marvel game with bloody heart attack stuff. <laughs> I think that's been like that all season, to be honest. Yeah. Except from the most comfortable except one was the Hampton game, one five one. But that. For a lot of the seasons we have but that was like. Oh, my phone's in stereo, so I'll look at it in a minute. Right. I've got. I'm going to go down the stereo in a minute. So, Jesus, bloody! This video is going to be two hours long, but that's alright. I don't get that. Pass it to Taylor. Pass it to Taylor. No mind. Don't pass it to Taylor. Ayer, what are you doing, Ayer? Either pass it back to Scott Bain or huff it up the park. Don't pass it to bloody. Don't pass it out the park. Do you know what I mean? Just don't pass it to a bloody St. Mirren throwing. Like, that's just daft. Yeah. Oh, God almighty. Players are falling apart here. Well, St. Mirren have not even scored their players are falling apart. Right, come on, that's good. Come on, McGregor. Come on. Christie. Christy, you bloody qualified for the bloody Euros and you still can't bloody tackle a St. Mirren player. That's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Embarrassing and, it's, you know, it's gone by angry bulb for the Celtic season. It's just laughable. It's hilarious. Like, Celtic have been, have come from the one of the bloody, be one of the best team in Scotland to, like, the, the laughing stock of Scotland. Aya, how have you gave that fill away? You're bloody about six foot and you've gave a foul against a wee tiny guy. How's that? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, they're going to take a bloody long free kick. They know our strategy. They know our bloody our st our statistics. Statistics. That's a, a, a tongue twister, that. Do you know what? The, we're the worst bloody team in, in, Scott, um, in the Premiership for conceding bloody um, set pieces. Keeper's ball, yes, keeper. Yep. Grab on, just take your time, Scott Bain. Chill a bit. Oh, God. 
See, F is, F is, F is, if F, I can't even pronounce, I can't say English, right? English is hard right now. If this was Rangers playing and they were winning 1 0, I would say they're in a comfortable lead. But for Celtic this season, it's not. That's a, uh, it's either a free kick to Celtic or a throw in. I don't know. Roderick's looking for a free kick. Patrick Kamala's coming on for Celtic. Oh, I didn't know that until recently. He's got his hair back. I didn't know it. There you go. I remember he shaved his hair off when the pre season. Yeah. And he's got his hair back. Maybe Kamala can get us a goal. Maybe. Maybe yes, maybe not. <laughs> I mean, at least it's not a Man United West Ham game, because that was the most boring game I've, I've watched. I went extra time, but Scott McTominay scored, so. Yeah. That proves when you have your first team players on the park, you get you win, you know? Turnbull! Ah, oh, I should have shot her, Turnbull. Rogic! Far too many touches sometimes, man. The, every player takes far too many touches. Edward. Pass it, Eddie. Jesus. Taylor. McGregor. Taylor. Why doesn't Taylor go to the byline? Edward turns the defence. Edward. That's a free kick. Ref. Come on. Oh, alright, he's going to play on then. I'd like to take the free kick, to be honest. Maybe Edward score or Davy Turnbull. But Turnbull wins it. Oh, yes. We've got a free kick in a dangerous area. Surely David Turnbull will take us. Come on. And Lewis, if I hurt your ears with celebrating, <laughs> there's no sorry for that one because Celtic will score. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a soft foul, but we'll take it, eh? We'll take it. I think it's just out. Oh, I don't know. Nobody bothered Oh, God, Lewis. Christie's over the bloody free kick as well. Oh, God almighty. Christie will probably hit it over and bloody hit somebody walking home with a shopping. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? If David Turnbull plays FIFA, try the TikTok cat, you know, go low, go low. <laughs> I nearly worked against Lewis in FIFA, so... I don't know how I did it, actually. I just went for it and I scored it. Yeah. David Turnbull looks like he's going to... David Turnbull looks like he's going to take it. I don't know. Ryan Christie's position. I don't know if David Turnbull's going to take it. I hope he is. Because if Ryan Christie takes it and doesn't score, that's a waste of opportunity. Right? Come on, David Turnbull. Take it. Come on, Davey. Take it. Take it, Davey. Away you go, Christie. Away you go. Back to Aberdeen. And wh where has he come from? Inverness, right? Because David Turnbull would have scored that. He shoots it right into the bloody wall. I mean, we still have it. But that's shocking. Penalty! It's a penalty to Celtic! It's a penalty to Celtic! Nick Walsh has pointed to the spot and St Mirren are gobsmacked. Hmm. That's a, that's a clear on penalty. David Turnbull passes a, a sensational ball through to... Is it Greg Taylor? It's Greg Taylor and it's a shove by, it's a shove by the St Mirren defender and he shoves Greg Taylor to the ground and it is a penalty to Celtic. I am still not confident with a penalty lose. I don't know who's going to take it. Is it Edward that's going to take it? He's, just, he's a penalty taker, isn't it? Yeah. Ayer's still like saying it could be a red card. Ayer's saying, you know, where's the red card, ref? He's only booked him. He's only yet... Oh, God, it's, it's Edward. I don't know. Uh, I, I don't... I, I, see, any penalty, even like a, a team I don't support, I don't look at it. It's actually nervous. Nerve-wracking. Yeah. Celtic yeah. have the chance now to go 2-0 up in a game where... You know, I can't see still and a, and, a, and a game where we shouldn't, well, I don't know, we've not deserved anything really. We're 1 0 up. Can Edward make it 2? I don't know why I'm watching it. It's like a bloody horror film that I don't like, but I'm still watching it. My eyes appeal to it. He scores! Sit down, Sit Mirren! Sit down! Sit down! Odds on Edward makes it. Sit Mirren now. Celtic 2. I will make that now to the. to the. um to the. um the title, uh, sorry, the, oh. oh, 13 now, I wish it was 13 now, but it's not, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Edward, that's how, that's how Edward's name spelled as, right, um, right, I need that, and I need that, there we go, uh, <laughs> Jamie Vard is having a bad, <laughs> I wore a St. Mirren, uh, a St. Mirren top. I wore a, oh, and Edward, that was his final touch of the game. Edward's coming off for Kamala now. 
Oh. Right, um, as you're saying, I wore a, a, a Leicester City shop when I was on holiday and about three years ago. I was walking by some English pubs and all the English fans were going, Jamie Vardy's having a party when I was walking by with a Leicester shirt. That was a year, that was a year Leicester City won the league. And I was ah, like, I, I watched a bit of football, but I didn't really, was interested a bit, you know. Yeah. But Lewis, my scoreline's gone now. It's yours, it's, it's, it's yours to win now. Here comes McGregor though. Go on McGregor, use your pace, go on. Kamala, he's got it through to Kamala, who's just came on, first touch, back to Taylor. Oh, he beats him. Oh, Taylor just sent that guy back to wherever he came from. Lovely from Taylor. Rogic. Now we're 2 up, we can play a bit of confidence now. The fact is, the fact that the keeper went the right way, I thought, oh, this keeper's going to save it. He's a, he's a decent keeper. He wasn't a decent keeper when he played for Rangers, God knows. He let in five against us when we were in the league seven in a row. Uh, but he's a decent keeper, but Edward just puts the power past him. Lovely. <laughs> I thought Edward was going to do one of them skill, you know, the, the skill. The, they did it, did it against Craig Gordon in the, cup fin the Scottish Cup final. And Gordon was raging with him. See how he did that skill penalty with him? They scored it. He was raging. He, he get booked for throwing the ball at him. It was raging. <clears throat> but you know one thing we won this season is the quadruple treble, which Rangers will never win, so... No. No, I kind of regret only recently getting into football. Mm hmm Because there's just so many good moments I've had. <laughs> Bloody, see when Roderick put in that 2-1 win against Aberdeen in the Scottish Cup final on the treble? I was lighting up. You know when we party flares that you get in Tesco? Yeah. Oh, yes! Sit down, St Mirren again! It's an own goal! What's St Mirren doing? It's Ryan Christie! It's Celtic 3! St Mirren now. But, um, you know when we... Um, party flares, like a wee firework... Pss, 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 pss. It doesn't actually go up there. I, I, I liked one of them when Roderick scored the winner, uh, when he trebled for Celtic. Well, I didn't like it, of course, it was my mum that did it, just on YouTube. What's the, it hits off the post, it's a lovely, lovely curling shot from Ryan Christie. Hits off the post and it's in the net, yeah, lovely. Not an own goal, it just hits in the net. How come the second half we've just been the better side now? Like, I don't understand, we were horrific the first half. Horrific, I mean. I think it's Lewis, it's your good luck. I tell you, every live stream you're on now, yeah. Celtic was one. <laughs> Here comes Celtic again. Jesus, Celtic are on the attack again. Here comes Kamala! It's again! It's Patrick Kamala! Oh, it's David Turnbull! David Turnbull scores again! Oh, Four it's 4-0 Celtic, inside yeah, seconds, inside seconds a 3-0, it's 4-0, it's David Turnbull and St Mirren are doing in it. David Turnbull played very well, it's a lovely ball, I tell you what, from Kamala, I tell you what, lovely ball from Kamala, I thought it was Kamala that scored actually, and it is now Celtic 4, St Mirren 0. St Mirren 0. Yep, Turnbull with the goal. I'm gonna to have to get rid of live watch along because, well, yeah. I, won't, I won't fit in all the names. Yeah. There we go. So our both our predictions are all going to shreds. Thank God we we don't bet. <laughs> Mine was one 0 Celtic and yours was two one. So far we've clipped the bloody Jesus Christ off. He nearly knocked that guy out. It's like a one of them rugby tackles. Yeah. <laughs> it's a booking to Shane Duffy as well. Um. So far, we've got a clean sheet, um, about six minutes to go in the game. Yeah, six minutes to go in the game. Um, Shane Duffy getting a yellow card for that um, foul there. Um, and yet again, second half, we come alive, eh? You know? Wow. 4-0 mm -hmm. now, now, it's a good lead. Good now that we're winning 4-0. We only have five, uh, uh, six minutes to go now. 
Oh, it's like David Turnbull's coming off now for Celtic. He's done a fantastic game. And Rogic. Rogic and Turnbull coming off for Celtic. And it will be Lee Griffiths and Moy El Unisti coming on for Celtic for Tom Rogic and Turnbull. Good performance from both teams. Both players, Turnbull and Roger getting on the goals, um, goal, goals today. Can I honestly or Griffiths get, get the five? Maybe. But St Mirren have a set piece here. Can we keep a clean sheet? That's our important piece. Can we keep a clean sheet? It's headed away. Griffiths will get an end yet. No, he won't. It's tackled. Griffiths will get it now. Griffiths does well. Gets it to... Oh, nearly gets it to Kamala. Or Ellen, I don't know who that was I mean, it better's a goal difference, but that's what I can do. 4 0. Sit Mirren. Uh, it's uh, Scott Brown now. It's good to see Scott Brown getting 80 minutes on his on his feet. That's good. Because normally I would see Scott Brown come off for about 70 minutes, but he's not. He's kept his tail on, which is good. Ayer, Taylor, bits up the park, Brown, good good touch from Brown, oh, referee, that's a late one on Brown, no, nope. referee says play on, McGregor, nearly gets it to Kamala, oh, Taylor wins it back, McGregor, Taylor, Kamala, uh, Elunusi, sorry, Christie, out wide to, who's that? I can't see. John Joe Kenny, maybe? Oh, free kicks. Free kick to... Free kick to St Mirren. About three minutes to go in the game now. You know, I've got to say, both teams have done... Uh, both teams... Celtic have played well in the second half, definitely. First half, Roger got the goal. Really. Wait, Tom Roger got booked? What did he get booked for? Did he get, I don't know why Tom Roger got booked there. He never done anything but set from score the goal. <laughs> And you can't even you, you can't celebrate with the fans because there's no fans to save them. So <laughs> don't know why you get booked, but you know, might I celebrate in front of the 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 plastic um you know the the cardboard um St Mirren fans you know the you know how some yeah you might I might celebrate in front of them. <laughs> Somebody's phoned up saying oh Tom Roderick should be booked. <laughs> oh, but you know I'll take I'll take four now. It's three points in the end, isn't it? I mean, look, I, I tell you, it's the power of... Ooh, Saturday Night Football, Man City take on Tottenham. Tottenham's defence is a bit of rubbish, by the way. I'm not surprised. Uh, I'm not surprised if Everton beat them tonight in the FA Cup. I'm going to see the score. Oh, is that a free kick Celtic? It's not. Here comes Kamala. Oh, he's getting blocked. Everton are winning 4-3 against Tottenham. What a game that is. 4-3? That, that, that was a good that was a good saver from Bain. Bloody Duffy putting him in trouble. We'll see this. So some in an attack here. I'll, I'll talk a bit more about the Everton game in a minute. Bloody hell, Duffy, your touch is like a balloon. It nearly causes trouble. Um, yeah, it's 4-3 4-3 Everton about 25, uh, 15 minutes to go in that game. FA Cup, so... There you go. That's going to be an FA Cup classic, surely. 4 3. Here comes St. Mirren cleared by Christie. Jesus, Lee Griffiths is running on. Yes, he's got it. Lee Griffiths, cross it in the box. Oh, is that? Oh. Throw into Celtic. I think Griffiths has got his speed back. I tell you that, he's got speed on him. Mm -hmm. As I was saying before, I was talking about Duffy, I'm making a mistake in Everton. Um, I tell you, the power of Lewis being on Discord and talking to us through the game has brought us Celtic winning, I'm telling you. Yeah, we go from 2-1 while I'm in person to... Or now while I'm 
God, okay, I'm gonna say when's it back for us now. And there's talks about Celtic, as I said in the Celtic Mind podcast, if you haven't checked out, no. Celtic Mind podcast is always on a link in my channel. We talked about, I want to say, reportedly, Celtic are going to, going to buy him in the summer. About six million. That's, that's a, that's, that's dear. Bargain? I mean, it's a bargain, you know, I want to say, worth 16 million, but, yeah. It's 10 million, 10 million cheaper, but, I don't know. Probably Celtic will go from. He's a good player, I'll give him that, he's a good player. He's better, le- he's better left mid than we've got, I would say. McGregor Brown, just playing again a game of Yee Hidi Boy. Yeah. That's not a foul, yep. Elena Set. Turns, turns St. Mirren like a rap. <laughs> Elena has still got the ball. 90 minutes have been played. There will be 5 minutes added because of that injury to Steve- Stephen Welsh. So. I think the referee, um, I was about to say, if Stephen Wilson didn't get injured, I was going to say it. I think the referee's thinking that Celtic are Rangers, you know, adding on five minutes, but we've, we've won four now, so there's no way St. Minnan can be back in five minutes. So. McGregor. <coughs> Aye. So, is she like when lay out by the team and the predictions and the, the score? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, as I was, um, do you like the new layout? Like I've got the team, the the score, and the yeah. Bits of team, yeah. yeah. So obviously, guys, our predictions didn't come true, but thankfully, you know, they didn't come true because we could we could when they conceded, we'd be nervous at the end, one nil, um, even two one as well. So four nil, it's the same as last week's result against Kamak Kelly. So we'll take it. Filled by Kamala. Kamala, more me, it was Kamala get filled by some Mirren player, but alright. I don't know if Kamala will be a Celtic player in the future, I really don't. I don't, I, I don't see it right now anyway, I really don't. Maybe in the future, maybe in the future. Because there's definitely going to be a, a, a big clear out of Celtic yeah. this, um, in the summer, definitely. Yeah. Like, like your Edwards will go, your maybe even Ayer will go, maybe. I see that going. I don't Ayer will leave now. Mm. Oh, Duffy's oh, actually... I won't play. I won't play when I play one, two. I think you got attractions from AC Milan or somebody like that. Yeah, but now AC Milan have enough defenders. Oh, yeah, so they do, yeah, I was yeah. I can't remember, did they sign... Did... Uh, they took the Chelsea centre back on them. Oh, yeah, yeah, to Mori, yeah. He did, yeah. So, I didn't have a, I had a shot there. It was defl- deflected by, I think it was Duffy. Mm. Let's see. Hey, it was Duffy. No, oh, it, was, it wasn't even deflected by Duffy, it was a goal kick. Yeah. Big Duffy just standing there with his big legs like that. Oh, God. Thank God we've got yeah, a bit... Mm. Yeah. Thank goodness we've got a 4 0 lead, because if Duffy was on and we're only winning 1 0, that would be torture to watch. Still was torture to watch for it. Until we got the 2 0 lead, I was like, you know. That's ten goals we scored in like in a week. Four goals against Kelly, two goals against um, Marwell, and four goals against St Mirren tonight. Ten goals in three games. That's not bad. And we've only conceded one. We only conceded one in three uh, three games. I'll take that. Better than our own. Half bad. Yep, not half bad. For Celtic right now, that is not half bad. <laughs> Yeah, there's only only two minutes less uh, only two minutes to go now in this game. Celtic so just you know they could go for a fifth, but I don't see him going for a fifth. He comes down honestly though. It'll be a corner Celtic. Corner at Celtic, no? I don't know. I'm pretty sure Elnussi didn't shoot that. If Elnussi shoot that, well, God knows. Yeah, it's a corner at Celtic. Yeah, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, corner at Celtic. Okay, Elinus is just 
Okay then. <clears throat> did, did anybody buy your players and where's now? Uh, no, so I'll have to be last one. Oh. Aya hates it. Taylor clears. Duffy heats it. Christy heats it. Postdale Unisate. St. Mary win it back. Crosses in. St. Mary head it. Duffy heats it away. And it will be a St. Mary throw in. What? That will be full time any second now. As soon as this ball's thrown, Jim Goodwin not happy with his team, but. It's full time in Paisley, it's St Mirren now, Celtic 4. It's been one of those games, Lewis, where the first half was rubbish. We did get the goal, but in the end, we get the three points, guys. Lewis, I'm just going to end the video real quick right and I'll talk to you for a minute. Right? Cool. Thanks, guys, for watching. I are live on, um, oh, live on um, Twitch or on YouTube, which will be um, on shortly. Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.